think about mermaids in the water being one with the aquatic creatures that live within the ocean. It is, you are being submersed in this blue atmosphere. And even though she isn't <clears throat> in a mermaid um, attire or anything along these lines, um, she is in this bold yellow uh, dress uh, sort of movement type of costuming here and it flows really well within the water and it's a really nice balance between this blue and this yellow and we're getting cut to these different creatures that live within these waters and we're kind of seeing her movement kind of mimic these movements so it's a really nice soothing piece to watch even within the music that's being added onto this piece the color grading and the color correction and cinematography i think is very well done in the music um and most importantly the narration which takes its form in a spoken word and spoken poetry format which i think is always very effective because those sort of work well together um and i just also wanted to acknowledge the efforts of filming near water and underwater um, i'm sure that that wasn't an easy take but it definitely played off, uh, paid off very well, um, and it plays very well, and it's a very appealing to the eye. There seems to be an invitation to uh, love and care for for nature, and takes the shape of this woman who's, uh, who's basically in the water and dancing in the water and floating in the water, as we see, we glances at different the different creatures living in the water. Uh, sharks and uh, uh, jellyfish and etc. Um, it's it's there's the sequence uh, when she's at the bottom of the of the ocean, dancing, floating, flying. Uh, that is very uh, poetic, very elegant, and uh, um, the film feels um, feels hopeful and uh, and full of heart. The colors that they, you know, they chose her to have like in, in this really, really beautiful gold dress in the ocean. I thought the colors kind of contrasted really, really nicely and really, really beautifully. I thought all of the ocean work was so, so impressive with um, like the, the, the restrictions and struggles with, you know, filming in a body of water. Um, I thought it was so, so beautiful. I loved the fluidity of the entire thing, not just the water. I thought it was really, really, really well done. This has very beautiful underwater scenes. They are majestic with the whale, the shark and the fish and many other ocean species showcased in this um, where time doesn't go by. It, it, felt, it felt like that. And... The music gives a gladiator film vibe, powerful piece to showcase this script with some a hopeful future. You have a nice choreography under the water with the fishes and and, and basically got the humans under water. We see this dancing, which becomes kind of a scuba diving slash swimming. And and uh, there is a beautiful, really pleasant music that gets uh, accompanies everything. Um, and then obviously the direction in cinematography follow the character under the water and and make it like a true uh, pleasant and, and beautiful uh, show. That uh, it really really kept me there.